Hello everyone, welcome back to some more Lord of the Rings Online. We are here in the bleak cellar at the Haunted Inn, talking to Asiriel, and have the of we have to go and reassure some nervous maladrim throughout this place. So, surely you've noticed the feeling of dread that hangs over portions of this place. I'm not going to try and say that. Uh, I did not think much of it when we arrived, but my unease has grown, and now others are reporting seeing strange specters throughout the town. Do you mind, uh, could you pack my mind at ease? I would ask you to speak with some of the elves. Uh, about the disturbing things they've seen and reassure them all will be well. I cannot, we cannot tarry here much longer, and I will nervous maladrim among us. I, I want the nervous maladrim to know, uh, among us to know that we are safe while we must stay. Uh, so, yeah, we're just gonna have to say everything's good. We all good. Don't feel scared. And those guys should probably be the ones outside because I saw at least two that I know of. Nervous guys. It's this guy over here. Who we can talk to? I have seen ghostly Continue. shapes in the half light, just on the edge oh, of sight. That's not good, is it? And then the one down here, and then the other one over there. Um. So let's go talk to you. I cannot shake the feeling that something is very wrong with this village. Well, it's a bit burnt down. That might be what's we wrong with that. We cannot move on from Odegaim quickly enough for me. Yep, I'd like to... Odegaim? Is that how you're supposed to say it? I would... Yeah, I would say that completely wrong. <laughs> Definitely. That's why I don't say things. It's long words in this game. Uh, yeah, so let's go back down. That's a very easy quest, and we can actually see where these go to, because I've now un done these so they can level up so uh you know i know it gets shared over all of them but as long as they're leveling up i'm happy with it there so we can go from six to level nine well. damn it's been a lot decision has been made my mind is more at ease see now the thing is these are gonna get needing to reforge in a minute and that's not so all the xp is gonna go to there which is a, a fun time so talk to a serial and travel along rad it Eorist with the Hidden Guard. That'll give us some rep, some legendary to make speed, and some gauntlets, which obviously aren't going to be as good of as our Madam Hunter's gloves. Though, this is uh, very, very close to where it is, considering this is what a level 63 quest, and those are 67 armor. It's very, very close. The Scuttledales are full of danger. Now, the Hidden Guard must brave the dangerous woods and canyons of the Scuttledales, home to the Sewithiel. A brood of venomous spiders that will brook no intrusion. Okay, this all sound all perfect and good. I love spiders, me. That's a lie. Um, make our own bleed. I'm in need of power. We'll go with that uh, again. And defend Mazog. And defeat these lovely spiders. Where were you when I needed the poison earlier? Or the whatever it was I was picking up from you. Where was the poison? I can't remember. Even more. Come on. Let's get you sorted. Not getting as much focus as I wish I was. Because I'm running out, which is not good for us. And even more spiders. Damn it. I actually do want to see if these guys are going to level up to level 10 before the quest finishes, which looks like it's likely. Considering we're getting 252, admittedly that shed over 4. So let's say they're getting like, you know, 50, 60 ish. 62, let's say, XP each time. Uh, I actually, actually, we can work out how much they're getting. 81 XP. I was very off, but. Oh, this, this seems like uh, it's not going to be like the same thing again. Just secure his shackles and. I can travel on. If you're frightened, you can turn around. I'm not frightened. I don't like spiders, but... Well, it's not like I dislike spiders. I more dislike spiders if they're that big. Um, so... If I was a weak like you, Alpha, I would not be caught dead out here. Or maybe I would. I'm not going to be dead out here. Right. Let us... Can I choose this before I talk to you? No. Because now it's going to let me. Uh, I'm going to say offensive. I need someone to help me. These guys are a little high, uh, high health for me to just constantly do on my own. But yeah, these, uh, these might actually get to level 10 before, 
uh, we finish, which will actually be kind of good because it means the majority of it will get thrown into here at the finish of the quest, unless we uh, reforge them before the quest finishes, which uh, we could do if we wanted to, but yeah. Wait, which way? This way. We're going to secure his shackles most likely, I guess. Wait, what is that? Not this way, not this way. Don't go that way. Okay, we'll have to go the other way, which is full of webs, which is not good. Because, uh, if you remember correctly, there was uh, a prophecy from Galadriel to do with some webs, and that is, uh, not good. Potentially. Right. Talk to Ethereal. Female character. Prophecy. Beyond the webs to the northeast. This way. This is not going to be good. The words of Gladriel before her mirror surfaced in your memory. Yeah, see? If you remember. I see, I see. great webs strong beneath the trees. I didn't even need to say it. I was going to, and then she said it. These guys shouldn't be too difficult. They seem to be one by one, so... Easy time. As long as we have focus, which we seemingly never have anymore. And they've just been leveled up to 10, so... Fun. A friend in peril. Her life's blood mingling with venom and remorse. Yeah. I thought being on a mission of such importance would give me bravery enough, but among the webs my courage fades, and I wish to be home. It was wisdom to come this way, but we need secrecy, but here in the dark it's difficult for me to truly know it. I rely upon you to provide me commands using this Maldron banner. Um, I will support you as I did with the Drown, or with power, morale, or a bit of both together. My courage will be greater against the spiders of this place. We are not alone, they return. Let's go do this, and we need to save her and make sure she doesn't die, obviously. Hopefully, maybe. I can't remember. <laughs> Particularly. Alright, so she's giving me power, which is good. Uh, obviously. Because morale isn't a big issue, because we're not really taking much hits from these guys. Uh, it's just, you know, being able to hit them the most with the powers. Uh, the priority. They seem to be switching, so it seems to be this side, then this side, then this side. Or both, apparently, in this situation. But one time I say it. Or maybe they were doing it all the time, I just wasn't paying attention. Alright, you're done. Not, not done yet, though. What are you doing? Hiding behind a rock. Come on. Come on. At last, their attack ceases. Or their attacks cease. Same thing. Different words. Same words, really. Just different way of saying it. We've made it. Are you hurt? No, she should be okay, I hope. She didn't take much help damage, did she? No, she's regenerating. That's good. Follow Achador, Ethereal, and Mazog deeper into the Scuttle Dells. I feel like he's just trying to make the most noise possible. Like, yeah, it's not... Yeah, just, yeah. And the lights turn purple. You know it's probably not a good thing. And he has now stopped. And talk to you. Something's wrong. Can you feel it? This place is not safe. Wait for a cereal to decide what to do. Or not. Apparently. I'm a bit stuck. Can't really. Your legs may be bound, but mine are not. Mazog is escaping. My does not be bound by the webs. I will get Mazog back. No, that's no, that's not. Chattering evil shapes approach. Your bow longs to sing. Yeah, no, this is not good. <laughs> I can get. I feel like I can get free. How do I? How do I get free? I'm just doing that. Yeah, there we go. Let's get out of here. Oh, I need to help him. <laughs> I was gonna leave you, I'm sorry. 
I need to defend him while being... Feels like I'm being slowed down. I think it's more the fact I'm walking backwards. We have to hope now that Ethereal is fine. If she's not, it's a bit of an issue. Because I think that might have been what's out in the prophecy. I can't remember. Too many, Hunter. Even should all your arrows find their marks. Yep, there's quite a lot of these guys. I'm going to go through the, this way. Oh, that is locked. Okay, a cobweb is locked. Okay, or a spider's web is locked. That's uh, nice to know. At least all these guys aren't attacking us. It's only a certain amount that are actually attacking us. I feel like we might have to use rapid fire. Oh, this is not good. Did you? She has full health. It's fine. If I kill you, I will be happy. You also count as being in self mode. Serial and Mazog have both been grievously injured. Their fate's uncertain. Uh, swooning on the just on the edge of consciousness. Her eyelids flutter weakly, but she does not seem to recognize. I do not know if we can face this foe. What this invisible foe right here with 57k health. But we all die honorably as members of the Hidden Guard. Oh, your guys are back. Cool. Nice to know. Oh, I've just realized what happens with the. Okay, that's fun. Right. Let's get on here. I have rapid fire. I will I will plan to use it. I'm gonna use set trap. Just to set a trap on a spider, because it's irony. Because you set a trap on me, so I set a trap on you. Play me, right? <laughs> it's payback at least. Right, this is a very easy kill when we have rapid fire and three other dudes helping us. Right. Sigleth. This is not how this is supposed to end, Alvella. Not only has our, uh, has our charge been poisoned by the venom of Sabreth, but so too has Isuriel. There are many. Uh, there may not be hope for survival for either of them. We cannot proceed any further like this. We must go to the nearest outpost of Maldrum and recover this sad from this sand development. We can recover. If we can recover, we can. If we can. Let's get out of here, though. I remember what happens. I'm not going to spoil it, because it's... Not fun. <laughs> the all oppose me. I shall slay a single orc should a Suriel die on this ill omened journey. Okay, you'll do that. Okay, talk to Broin at Ost Galad. 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 Is like, right now. I don't know. Broin's here. I think I called him Broin as well. It's not. Ha! The hidden guard? They cannot guard even themselves. We weren't very hidden either, to be fair. Uh, right. <laughs> Marzok cannot. Die. I do not want the hidden guard to fail. Mazog must not die. But, but you probably will then. It's not good. <laughs> okay, there's an antidote. Ingredients are rare. Uh, da -da -da. Unmarked venom sack from the same brew spider or black venom and a flower. Uh, the flower say Seragloch uh, grows upon the end of the barrows and Mirkwood. It blooms only for a few days in a year and dies. There may it not be any remaining this season. She gasps the air and a silence. So let's go find those and an unmarked Seawathel venom sack. Right then. Up, back to the scuttle dells we go. Always a fun time to be doing this. Uh, let's go out this entrance, it's kind of easier. I don't know if you can get out that way. Probably can, we can probably even check. Just out here. Yeah, we could have. What was the point in doing that? So we need to go all the way over there, which means that we're going to actually go over to here for that. Uh, and then up through here. And that is where the flower is. And this, that's in the graveyard area. And this is apparently where the spiders are, because I guess that's where we just were uh, in total. Or as a rule, generally, whatever. So, we have to hope that we can find this flower. Because it says it's rare and it only blooms for a few days every year or so, or whatever it was. What was it? Don't, it won't say it here, I don't think, but... Uh... Uh, the components are so rare that it's only realistic to expect a single dose. That's the problem there. Because two poisoned, one antidote. How are you gonna do that? 
probably not going to have a fun time. So, I also just realized we're getting like 25k item XP and that is a turn and we probably should have reforged while we were there. Um, we'll go do that in a minute. Because we've got to get back, obviously, and it's not like we're going to get to level 40 and everything not be ref uh, or need reforging by the time we get back. So, I think we should be good. Stay away from you. That failed. Alright, so... Let's just jump away. Let's get away from this lot. Shrine of the Ancient One. I have so many after me right now, it's not funny. They're hitting me. Oh, now, you, now you've done it. Now you've done it. I was going to let you be dead in peace. But... Now... Nah, you gotta... Oh, these guys are dropping uh, legendary weapons. Maybe we can be lucky enough to get a uh, Hunter's Bow of the third age. Or not. Might as well kill you, because you seemingly are uh, like a boss type guy. And you're probably going to give me a shard of something, knowing how this works. Come on. Oh, you didn't. I probably need to kill him for a quest then at some point. That's probably why he exists. Not you. And also go. Law Master's Book of the Third HC. I'm just getting everything that I don't want. And then I'm going to get, like... These are level, what, 64? Yeah, 64. I'm going to get, like, a level 64 uh, Hunter's Sword of the Third Age. And that's just going to be useless to me. Because, obviously, we have a Hunter's uh, level 65 Hunter's Sword of the Second Age. So, obviously, our sword beats that out. Come on. Take you out. Gotta really hope here. I kind of just want to be killing these guys now, just because they might give me a, a bow. That gives me something to focus my uh, item XP on. So yeah, I might actually just come around here, like, even on a different character, like the higher level character, and just sort of try and get myself a level 65. Spend a little bit of time doing that. It'll take a while, but, you know, it's doable. Alright, now we're out of this area where it's not actually going to be worth doing anything. There, so we need to now make our way... Uh, we'll get on our horse, it'll be easier. But we'll make our way up to this area where the spiders of that specific, uh, you know... What is it? Uh, unmarked venom attacks from Sewathel or Venom... Black Venom Spiders. Of the breed related to the spider that poison Mazog and a cereal may be found through the... So it has to be of the same breed is what it has to be, so. Let's hope that we get an easy drop and it's not going to have to be, you know, a bunch of not dropping for uh, ages. Because uh, that would kind of be frustrating. I also kind of want to check. I don't know if it's that quest we just did that would give us the... Also, these are the guys I can kill. Um... But yeah, we can hope. Nope, that didn't do it. Uh, I was just going to say we could... Oh, I got a heritage tree in there. We can uh, hope, though, that the... Uh, what am I trying to say? The deed we just... Or the instance we just did is a instance that allows us to travel back to where we were. Like, travel back to... This place, but now we have to go back here. So I'm not even sure if we could do that. And I don't really want to travel all the way back here to go all the way over here again. Uh, I would I would rather just go through the Scuttle Dells. Um, because it's quicker. Um, and I also just realized how super damn close we are to level 39 on that weapon. As well. So... Hopefully this should be a fairly easy way out. We can just sort of go over here and down and then across and get out of here. Be good. Not have too much of an issue because we should be able to outrun most of these enemies. The only reason we got knocked off our horse earlier is because of they had bows. Uh, which obviously means, you know, it's uh, a bit difficult to get away from uh, or outrun them when they can just be firing a bow and obviously have quite far range on that. When it's like a dog running after us or a spider running after us. He might get a hit to start off with, but they're definitely not fast enough at this point to uh, outrun a 78% speed steed. Which, uh, also, we never 
I just realized uh, never went on the new steed that we got from having Rise of Rohan. Maybe we'll do that when we get to Rohan. I mean, when we do that, we're probably going to have a war steed by that time. But there is going to be a little bit of a time uh, where we don't have a war steed, actually. So maybe we'll do uh, switch out there, even though I love the steed of the unflagging dragon uh, over, you know, pretty much any other horse at the moment. Because it looks so damn cool. Right, how close are we to being out? Very, very close. That's good. And uh, we'll do this and we'll bring the components for the antidote to a cereal and then we'll probably end the episode off for the day because getting a little bit uh, on the upper side of the, you know, it's, getting, it's in between my, my kind of threshold for the episode lengths. So, you know, I think this will be a good time to end it off. Uh, doing that. It depends how much longer this quest goes on for as well, because we might have to go do a few other things, like, you know, get get the person to make the antidote, and then, you know, actually give the antidote to whoever we're going to give it to, and all that stuff. So, it might still have a little bit longer, but I will definitely just do this quest, and that'll be it. Uh, we won't go and do another quest. I think it'll add a bit too much time on at the end. So, now I need to find... We might as well reforge these guys. Swilad Melon. That's deconstruct. Why do I always pick the wrong one? Hail, friend, and well met. Oh, it's just I don't care about the uh, what we got on them. To be fair. And then this is gonna be desperate flight cooldown because who who cares really? And then we need to find the area to get in there. It's over here, it looks like it is. Yes. Right. I have I have the components. You found, you found the components good. Found the components. Uh find Barvesian. Who is hopefully here, if I remember correctly. If I do remember correctly, they're up at the top of this tower. Let's even check. Barvesian, yes, they are. So let's give those there. And then we got to obviously work out who we're giving this to. Because the problem is we don't want to lose a cereal. Because, I mean, who would want to lose someone on your team? But at the same time, uh, I wonder if I can just jump over here. That's not going to work. And then I'm getting stuck on everything at the moment. So it looks like we'll go through here and under here. This place always confuses me going up here. But we'll uh, have to work out, you know, if we don't want to lose a cereal, really. Because it's a member of the, the Hidden Guard. But at the same time, Mazog is kind of our prisoner, and we are going to be trading him for Bosi and... Is it Bosi or Bori? I don't know. One of the two. I always mix them up because they're one letter apart. Uh, but yeah, we need to have hard decisions. Also, we just we got part of a deed completed, which is nice. A shirigrass flower? How did you find this? Uh, I went to where the undead were. Uh... Ladris, it is called, and I can brew it from the ingredients immediately, but there will only be enough for a single dose. I hope this will not be a problem. Yeah, about that. About that. That That's kind of an issue. Can we not go find another... I can kill more spiders. We just need another flower. Also, not to fall off, you know, this entire area. That would not be clever. But I'd do it anyway. Probably overall makes me lose speed rather than speeds me up from getting to a place because you know now I'm spending it for ages, you know, 18 seconds at like minus 60 percent or minus 40 percent speed. Actually, it's not even minus 40; it's it's guaranteed at 60, isn't it? No, I will not. Ethereal is barely conscious, but her mouth forms a thin line when she realizes what you're trying to give her. No, I will not take the antidote. You must give it to Mazog, or the hidden guard has failed. Don't do this. You refuse to take the antidote. Mazog is visibly ill. His body weakened from the effects of the uh, Gwigail poison. He still manages to sneer at you uh, as he gives in the Ladris. Oh, you're being alright. Uh, he manages to mutter uh, Kolf Rang Rang Rangis is, as he mutters as he gives a short barking laugh before lasping into sleep. And now your Mazog has received the Ladris poison in time. He should recover. I have, I have nothing to say to you. to you. Leave us. I can't understand how you came to this point. Saving the life of a filthy orc and allowing a friend to... to... Atrador visually uh, brings himself under control. Tell a crooked outside the door that no one to come into a 
Good Dorga, I want no one disturbing Ethereal, she needs rest. The scout should also be recalled in preparation for the exchange of Mazog. Let's go and talk to the person out here, and then we shall be done. Unfortunately, she refused to take the, po uh, the potion, you know, the antidote. So Mazog is now alive, but she has I understand. died. Uh, we are all doing everything we can. Okay, let's finish you, and we'll do that in the next episode. So talk to Le uh, Lego. Oh, because I basically talked to. Is that the three scouts? Yeah, it looks like it might be. Yeah, it is. And then bring them back. So we'll do that in the very next episode. But thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.